Hello humans, I'm Stormy and I'm with the Guild of the Pay at Pirate Fest and I'm here to talk to you guys a little bit. Now, we Fae have a special place called Vault of the Fae, and that's where a lot of our trinkets come from. I will show you a few and give you a little history of what it is. So, back in the day, the human and the fairies got along. We were friends, and we worked in peace, and we shared our knowledge together. But, however, the humans got greedy, as they tend to do and they used their magic that, they, that we had given them for the wrong purposes. So the Fae went around the world collecting all of their gifts and trinkets and hid them away in a vault. Now, we found that vault and we're here to bring the magic back to the human world. So I have a few little things. I've made a, I've got a few little space themed things because I love galaxies and the night sky it's just so calming and i enjoy working with the fairies that live in the galaxies we even offer a door that can bring them straight to you just put this in your home and the fae will come visit so i also have a little thing i would like to teach you guys today on how to make a calm down jar this is the final product here, which we have in the vault for you, if you'd like to get one. And what they do is calm you down when you're feeling very stressed, sad, or anxious. Take these and just shake out your frustrations and watch as the glitter falls down. And it's quite relaxing. I put little butterflies in mine. You can put beads or whatever you like. And I'm going to show you how to make one of your own. Now, you'll need a few items for your project. You're gonna need a bottle. I suggest plastic for the wee ones, but you can also use glass if you're careful. Some warm water. Some glitter glue and, you know, just some extra glitter. So, first what we're gonna do is add some warm water. I make it about halfway, a little more than halfway. I'm gonna shake up my glitter glue and get it all to the bottom. And then, ooh, I'm going to go ahead and add some. Now remember, you can always add more, but you cannot take away. So start off with a little bit, see how you like it, and then add some more if you think it needs it. And now, make sure you put on the lid really good for this part, because if you don't, well, you can only imagine what would happen. I'm going to need some more water, because the glue isn't dissolving all the way. So, there we go, we'll put the lid here, and give it another good shaky, there we go, a little bit of muscle, get that all stirred in, nice and good, and then, it's going to be pretty bubbly, don't worry, once it settles, it won't be so frothy. I'm going to add some more glitter because I love glitter. It's also known as pixie dust. It's a very similar consistency. And a little tip is I'd use a little bit chunkier glitter. The smaller glitter does tend to ball up. It doesn't look bad if you don't mind. I'm adding some purple because that's my favorite. Oh yes. And you know what? Just because some of these little guys that I've got from my galaxy fairies. So there's a little bit of 
galaxy magic in this jar. You can add beads or anything really, seashells even. So once you've topped it off, put your lid on nice and tight and give it another shake. And watch your worries slowly drift away into your galaxy jar. And that's how you make a calm down jar. It's not too hard. I believe in you. And it's very useful, especially during this time in the human world is very scary. And I can imagine how stressed out you guys must be. So go ahead and make one, make yourself feel better, be more like the Fae. And someday we'll have a place set aside at Pirate Fest for you to come visit us. So look us up, we're Guild of the Fae, and if you're a magic being yourself, you can come and join us. And if you're a human, you may visit and we'll show you our Fae way. So, stay calm, humans. Remember to breathe.